Hi, I'm Melissa, a nurse injector at Cynthia Gregg MD Face and Body Specialist, and this video is to educate you on Botox for tension neck. Here at Dr. Gregg's office, all three of the nurses are CAN certified to inject for tension neck. I will be educating you about the procedure in this video. Botox is not just used to soften wrinkles of the face, but can be used in a variety of different ways. Tension neck is the result of tense muscles of the neck and back that build up causing pain and contraction over time. The injection of Botox to the neck takes less than 15 minutes and can be injected into the muscle groups that are most tense on the patient. When in office, we will assess you and mark the areas that are tense and have built up over time. Patients often feel relief anywhere from 2 to 14 days after injection. I'm injecting Dr. Gregg in this video. There are several muscle groups that have tightened on her neck and trapezius, upper back area. I mark the muscles responsible and will inject into the muscle groups. There is also a cumulative effect to having Botox injections to the neck and upper back. Over time, the Botox will start to atrophy or debulk the strong muscles, allowing them to reduce and relieve the tense pressure and pain that they cause. Additionally, for women, if needed, the added bonus of slimming the trapezius muscle and shoulder area can make the shoulders appear less broad. Now, with the extensive use of cell phones, one side of the neck and upper back can build up causing tension and asymmetry. Here we will assess and determine if you need more Botox on the one side, relieving the asymmetry and reducing the pain and contraction. Here at Dr. Gregg's office, one of the nurses can determine if you're a good candidate for Botox for tension neck. Typically you can determine if you're a good candidate if you reach up to the neck or the upper back and upon pushing will feel pain, pressure, or tension. Contact our office today to determine if you're a good candidate for Botox for tension neck.